Okay, Trevor, let's see some moves. Come on. Yeah. Camera's rolling. Why do I feel like I'm just going to go right into the dip stuff? Because you're going to crash hard. That's why it feels like that. Yeah! Face plant! Oh, yeah! <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> Give us a thumbs up. There it is. Get up this thing before I start talking. What's, uh, what's to think? It's amazing new snow. Thanks for having me out. It's an awesome day. Visibility is still pretty decent and a uh, huge amount of new snow. It's crazy. Good. It's bad. Bad. Badass. Okay, Andrew, demonstrate our problem. Starter, go. Starter, stop. No hey. working. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to uh, take it apart and warm it up because we have a little ice ball in there. So we haven't found any ice. We just try to throw some heat on it to evaporate any moisture. Is that the idea? That's the hope. That's what I did last time and it worked. <laughs> Maybe the switch has seen its last day. Well, we haven't had any snow bike towing practices here. Maybe today is the big day. All right, so that didn't work. So now we're gonna try and boost this sucker right off the starter. Not recommended, but hey, it's better than towing a snow bike. It is. It's not doing anything. No. Why? Why is this being flashing on me? Am I doing it wrong? This is how Chad told me to do it. Why you do nothing? Just because you can't get in far enough? No, I'm touching the nut. Huh. Touching the nut. Well, I was pretty optimistic about that. Yeah, me too. I was all excited. <laughs> Shitty. Shitty. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> get a big long tow ride out. Guess what, guys? We have a new problem. You always say you always tow off the frame. Well, we might be able to get a find a little bit of frame in there, but our new big, huge, awesome shield covers up the entire frame so we can't loop our dimmy around it and pull. If you pull off the forks, you're just asking for all kinds of problems. Let's see what we can figure out. Okay, no problem. I found a way to get it through. It's a little bit tricky. A little bit tricky if you can see up there, but that part's gonna work. 
Okay, we're about to start towing. It's uh, one of the trickier things to do on a snow bike, that's for sure. Let's see if I make it past the first 10 feet. Okay, here we go. Hit it! Yep. Didn't move an inch. No. Oh. The slow, gentle start does not work. It's a hit start, as I recall. Let's try again on our nice uh, little paved path here. Somehow it came disconnected, but it didn't pull all the way through yet. Okay, here we go. I'm so tense right now. Okay, Andrew, just hammer it. Come on, go. Go, go, go. Get me out of here. <laughs> when Andrew's pulling, his ski becomes super light, so he has almost no steering. That's why he's ping ponging back and forth on the last bit. Okay, we're like 20 meters from the trail. Awesome. We're going to try and bomb start this thing. Try a bomb start here. There's a lot of powder. I'm letting out the clutch every now and then. I'm gonna try a higher gear. But it just slides. Okay. So neither Andrew or I have brakes because Yeti. So this is a little dicey maneuver. I got no brakes. Okay. Don't let me fall. Okay, <laughs> what a gong show, hey guys? Okay. This bike's really cold, so we're gonna let it warm up. You're still recording. Well, we did it, guys. Uh, bomb start on the trail. Then we got 20 kilometers to drive down. As long as I don't turn off the bike, it should be fine. That's it. See ya.